over three two one mark five minute period is in session for Royce and Kathy Richards unlimited 4A Brad Luce bring them out first boat away from the dock is the U11 the reliable diamond tool present Miss J and D's Thompson behind the wheel is the dock but then immediately off to his right with the beacon light of Lincoln he's in front of him now and right in front of the grandstand from Wald Lake Michigan Andrew Tate driving a U9 Delta real track you got them both right in front of you Jeff watch Tate he'll cut the course he's done it every time this weekend four minutes and 15 seconds until the start Wald Lake Michigan's Andrew Tate through the infield in the dominant white fluorescent orange and yellow trim on the U9 Delta real track Tom Thompson through the Whittier area on the front straightaway and the Chartreuse and Carnival Orange reliable Diamond Tool presents J&D's. We're down to two here in Unlimited 4A because of the scratch and withdrawal of U3, the Rooster Tail, 60 years of parties, air trap damage. I didn't get a mark, but I did myself. Yeah, I know what it was. Copy. Again, behind you. Two minutes and five seconds to the start of our Heat 4A. It is Andrew Tate and Tom Thompson. Tate coming through the corner up here, leading Tom Thompson. You'd have to think he's the odds-on favorite, but we saw a lot of speed out of that chartreuse and Carnival Orange U11 earlier today, Jeff. Take him down to Belle Isle. Coming up on the 145 mark, there it is. So we're down to two here, and Royce and Kathy Richards, unlimited 4A. And Brad, I really do not expect much shenanigans at all, but I've been surprised earlier today with these heat races. We've had gun jumps, we've had lane violations. Kind of funny when the human factor takes over inside that enclosed cockpit driving the world's fastest racing boats, the unlimited hydroplanes, 30 foot in length, 14 foot wide, 6,700 pound a racing vessel. We're coming up on the one minute period for 4A. We're five, four, Three, two, one, mark. One minute period has begun for Royce and Kathy Richards. Unlimited 4A. Above 80 is right on your outside. Lane number one, Delta Real Track from the Eastern Shore, Cambridge, Maryland. Tom Thompson and two. Brad, I expect it to stay that way to you. I'm sure it is going to stay that way. And while you were talking there, Jeff, I was thinking just how many times do you think Tom Thompson and Andrew Tate have squared off in a heat? These guys have been racing GP boats beside each other for darn near ever. Now they're doing it at the unlimited level. Coming up on 20 seconds until the start. Going to be Tate and one, Thompson on the outside. Got a two-boat shootout here in heat 4A of the APBA. We're at 10 seconds, Jeff Ayler. Start our heat. 
They look well behaved. Race fans were five, four, three, two, one. Mark appears to be a clean start. We're racing. Then Royce and Start is good. Start is good. Heat for A at the 2018 Metro Detroit Chevy Dealers APBA Gold Cup. The hazy conditions continue here in Detroit on this hot and humid Sunday afternoon. Tate on the inside, Thompson on the outside. Tate gets the big left-hand sweeper in first. Making a rooster tail advantage over Tom Thompson in second. Tate, your leader in U9 Delta Real Track. Tom Thompson second in U11. Diamond Reliable Tool presents J&D's. Brad, it's all Mr. Tate. And tail and a half. I don't think we uh, would expect much to be different from this. I think Andrew wanted to come out there, probably test a good combination that they may want to run in the final. And so he's going to pick them up and lay them down. One hot lap here for the U9 Delta Real Track. And Andrew Tate hammers his way through the corner. He looks mighty strong to me, Jeff Haler. We'll come down to complete lap number one of four. Unlimited 4A, sponsored by Royce and Kathy Richards, and a comfortable lead for Andrew Tate and U9 Delta Real Track. Brad, it seemed like he might have got off the throttle a little bit after he completed lap number one. Tom Thompson trying to garner those 300 points in second. Then the U11, Reliable Diamond Tool presents J and D's. Andrew Tate, your President's Cup winner here last year in Detroit on Saturday. Three wins on the 2018 campaign in Gunnersville, Alabama. Tri-Cities, Washington, Seattle, Washington. Mr. Lucy's looking for number four on the season later today. Yeah, and he has definitely pulled his foot. I think they put a combination in this boat and he wanted to come out and hammer it and see what they had. So I think he's using this as a pretty solid test session and talk about when he gets back, assuming everything stays the same, if this is a combination they may want to throw on this boat for the final, because they're going to square off and go five laps against four other competitors, one of which is going to be Jimmy Shane. But he's coming down to put two in the books, Jeff. Andrew Tate looks good to me. We're at the halfway mark of Royce and Kathy Richards. Unlimited 4A, and it's still Andrew Tate in front in the U9 Delta Real Track. Tom Thompson completes his second lap in second. And U11 Reliable Diamond Tool presents J&D's. Andrew Tate, your leader, turns it left, working the big left-hand sweeper, the Bell Isle Bridge turn. Andrew Tate's father, Mark Tate, a Gold Cup winner here in 1991 at Detroit in the Winston Eagle, 1994 in the Smoking Joes. Tate, two and a half in, lap and a half to go in front. Yeah, he's looking real good. And you know, you talked about the fact we're only running two boats in this particular heat, but that's the whole concept of the APBA Gold Cup. It was originally developed, the APBA Challenge Cup, and it was put together as an endurance race. When I was a kid growing up, Jeff, we used to run three heats of competition, three mile race course. It was a 90 mile race. You ran 10 laps. So this is part of the Gold Cup is the endurance. You've got to run all four of these heats. White flag is displayed for Andrew Tate. He accepts one more lap to go, Tom. 4A brought to you by Royce and Kathy Richards. Tom Thompson just completes his third lap in second. In the reliable diamond tool presents J&D's Tate in front, a fourth generation hydroplane driver. The roots, the blood is in his soul of hydroplane racing. Brad, I saw his late grandfather, Joe Tate, win a Grand National Hydroplane Heat years ago at Quake on the Lake at 70 years of age. Andrew's mom, Sandra Ray, was a Dynamite 145 pilot. Half a lap to go here in front in 4A. Yeah, the young man's definitely got racing in his genes, but I'll tell you what, he is doing this all by himself. He has taken H1 Unlimited by storm in only the second. How about again, Andrew? Look good. All right, I'm out a little wider here. He won the Seattle Seafair. Grandstand, give it up. He's going to come wide, Andrew Tate from Wall Lake, Michigan. Swinging it way outside. Great photo op. Checkered flag is out. Here's your winner of Unlimited 4A, 
Brought to you by Royce and Kathy Richards, Wald Lakes, Andrew Tate, and U9 Delta Real Track. Coming down to get second, Tom Thompson and Shannon and Scott Rainey's U11 Reliable Diamond Tool presents J&D's and Brad, I think both drivers did what they wanted to do and uh, Tom Thompson's cutting the infield. They want to put this 11 back on the trailer, eliminate the use of the cool off lap as Andrew is down in turn number one.